Hi there, welcome to the shop. On today's episode of Shit You Should Know and Shit You Should Have, painting. We're gonna do some painting. Now a lot of people, and for good reason, they'll use a spray can for stuff. I try not to. I use uh, regular automotive products. So, this episode of What You Should Know, What You Should Have, um, it may seem simple, but a lot of people forget it. You want to have everything you need at your fingertips, right? So, in my case, I've got my primer, I've got my activator, I've got a box of gloves, I got a hammer, I got a screwdriver, I got a paint stirrer, I got masking tape, I have the holder for my the Velvis K uh, D cups, uh, I have my mixing cap cup. And I have another large cup full of acetone that I use for cleaning. I have a gallon of acetone. I have paper towels. I have a garbage can. I have my little cap for the D cups. So, reason being is you want to be as efficient as possible. You also want to be as neat as possible. Now, if you were to judge me by this board you see here, Okay, I might be locking on the neat board. Uh, but, you know, with painting, stuff happens. Nothing you can do about it. So I have this little brush here for cleaning up and also use it to touch up a couple of pieces on what I'm working on. Uh, something else. When you go to pour your paint, right, before you pour it, obviously you want to mix it. Make sure there's no big lumps or anything coming off like this was when I first opened it. Okay, now a lot of people, they'll take the can, they'll pour it over here, or put it over here, and then they'll start pouring, and then they got this big run coming down the front. Let me show you something. Up your own little funnel. The uh, mixing cups make everything easy. This is a one to one mixture. I have a one, I have a one, I'm actually going to two because I found out before one wasn't quite enough for what I wanted. Maybe one and a half. If this looks a little on the thick side, it is. Now. How much of a mess did that make?
one and a half. There. Now, what you should have, if you do a lot of painting, it's worth it to invest in these D cups or if you're using the uh, PPS system, okay, there's a couple of different brands. Now that goes in there. That goes in there. Acetone. a big cup, grab another towel, Now, am I the kind of person to use five dollars worth of acetone to clean a five to one dollar cup? Yes, I am. Also, forgot how gravity worked there for a second too. That guy's ready for another use. Take her cat. So I'm ready to use this. And I can go in there and store my product. Once I'm ready to use it, that guy's ready to go to work. You need to know well what you're going to need to do the job in my case i already know if you're doing a painting job you're probably going to need pretty much the same stuff do you need to have all this well no not really but if you want to make things go quick and easy on yourself this is what you need to do it the right way i love the seaswood stuff um, this epoxy primer is a direct to metal. Uh, it's a one to one, it's easy to mix. I love these D cups, they make cleanup so much easier. Take that whole sleeve, throw it out, clean up my gun, I'm ready for the next step. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. That's going to do it for shit you should know and shit you should have. We'll see you later.